Welcome to uh, the dresser build day, what, like 4.25, something like that, because I don't know how much I want to get done today. I'm on my lunch break at work. So here's what's going on. The first thing that I've done is taken this pipe, centered it, and drawn a line basically where I need to cut this piece, and then I'm going to tack weld the nut to it because you don't want it to loosen up, and then I will weld this piece to there have to make sure that it turns true. If it doesn't, that's not good. Stage one, done. Stage two, tack welding nut. Nut. Tack welded. All right, what am I up to now? Like stage three, this is like one of the most important ones. Maybe stage two, I can't remember. I've already lost track. Um, trying to get this thing centered <laughs> on the nut because it has to be like right in the center too. So hopefully it's gonna work. Boy, I've got my two tack points there and there. If you ever weld galvanized metal, don't breathe the fumes. Very, very bad. Let's do this. All right guys, so the welding is complete and variation, that's the amount of variation at the top. Obviously not too much down here. So overall, happy. All right, the next thing that we need to do is we need to drill some holes. The holes that we drill are going to be to put the long tube all up into the center. Now, here's where everything gets really, really freaking interesting and complicated because there's a little bit of variation on this and the only drill bit that I have available, and it just so happens that I've got this like foot and a half long drill bit, this is one inch. This tube is just about one inch. So I don't have a whole lot of room for error. Some of the holes are gonna have to be augered a little bit. First hole is drilled. Second hole should be like right over there. Okay, and right now the motor's turning. I've got all three holes drilled, so the tube is, or the pipe or whatever, is going all the way through it. I do have a problem. I know I'm gonna run into it after I mount this motor. Once I get the motor, like, bolted up, the tube is going to probably um, drag on those holes. So like I said, I'm just gonna have to auger the holes a little bit once I get to that point. But it's starting to get done. That's the important thing. So freaking happy right now. Yes, 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 yes. No happy dance holes done though. Before I get ahead of myself and lose you guys, I have trimmed the top of the pipe so that the whole thing now fits inside the dresser, apparatus, thingamajig, all the way up to the top. And I did have to auger this hole out right here to get this part right here to recess up into it. And you can see that I've drawn approximately where the holes go. If it busts out on the side, it's not a big deal. I'm gonna use washers to level or to um, carry the load of the, the torque or the stuff in between you guys will see. <sighs> okay, the motor is temporarily connected just so that I can see where the sticky parts are and you can listen to the motor. And by the movement, you can see that there are sticky parts still. So I need to go through and like I said, auger my holes. So I'm going to auger now. All right guys, just a real quick note to say that when I got home today, oh my gosh, I looked at the computer and draw panel hallway vid is at 106,099 views. The scary thing about it, thumbs up, 666. Scary. And uh, you guys have also noticed I haven't been doing subscriber shoutouts anymore. Simply because, and I'm not complaining at all, I mean, I'd like to be able to do it, but just today so far we've had 20, so <laughs> I don't want to sit there and bore everybody with my poor pronunciation of everything, and there's Lori Lee. Hello. Trivia question, guys. What is this cat's name? 
We've said it before. Post it down in the comments. Ha, 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 ha. You guys didn't think I was going to do that, did you? I'm not proud about the way that I've got this motor connected. The thing about it is that you use what you've got, right? And I already made one trip to the hardware store on my way home, and I'm not going back. So bear with me. It's functional, and it works, and nobody's going to see it, so it doesn't matter, right? Okay. So the motor's mounted. I originally recessed these holes simply because at work I wanted to see what the variation was and if I needed to do the holes bigger or whatnot and the bolts that I had for this weren't deep enough so I had to recess the motor up a little bit. Since then I've taken washers and I've taken up the space so that this is secure. On the other side uh, the bolts that I got at the hardware store were a little bit long but the next size down were too short and I wasn't at work anymore so I wasn't able to cut them and make it look neat but it's like I said it's functional and it works. All right, getting her done. I've already said that. Oh, and I started filming this, and I was like, okay, step one, step two, step three. Yeah, I've lost track now. The gentleman behind me is loading up the pallets, and I got my $10. I got my $10. So that's really cool. So the pallets are leaving. Pallets. Yes, the pallets are leaving, and I'm still continuing to work on this. He says one more load. I say maybe one and a half. So it happened again. That's not the first one tonight. There's actually one more right there, and one more right there. Mmm. Yummy. I want to suck your blood. I want to suck my blood. So I got tired dealing with shaft variation, and I did something that I think is pretty ingenious. That right there is sandpaper. I took sandpaper and put it in there and I'm just gonna let it run for a little bit and hopefully it should uh, do the job. Take care of it, get rid of it, be gone. Adios, sayonara. Yes. She came out here because her and JD are like, what is that noise, stop it! It's driving me crazy. <laughs> and all the dogs in the neighborhood are barking too. It's really kinda cool. I was like, what can I do to make that stop? <laughs> he said, I need some sandpaper. I don't got any sandpaper or whatever. I'm like, I have some in my junk chore. <laughs> I yeah. have everything in my junk chore. I don't know why. You, you know what the Hellmouth squeak was, right? Mm -hmm. That rocking chair? Yeah. Alright guys, welcome to the 2012 version of the Hellmouth squeak. How long do you think it'll go before it drives them nuts? <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> Alright guys, I couldn't decide which comments to read and which ones not to read, so I want to try and do this really fast. It's going to be kind of like, you know, speed COC. So speed cock, if you will. So what time is it? Time for cock. Exactly. Brewer, Gar Brewer Guy 33, love! I can't believe it's not butter. Well, thank you. And new commenter. It's, it's nice to know somebody loves it as much as I do. <laughs> Ramoth Tall, LOL, I've got to get a compressor as well this year for the haunt. Good idea on getting the extended warranty. I bought a pancake compressor from them last year and it lasted six months before it blew up. LOL and yes, no warranty on it. Sad face. <laughs> warranty, very important. As to the wiper motor, you're more likely to break a finger before you'll break the motor by holding onto it. Absolutely. I found out today that thing is damn strong. Strong. Stop endangering your fingers. Yes. I already hurt myself several times today. Nobody can say that I don't bleed for the haunt. Mr. Bulldozer videos. Hope Lori Lee is doing better. Much better, thank you. We'll keep her in our prayers. Troy, check this out. What's the best thing about Halloween? Freebies! He didn't say that. Whoa. I kind of threw it in there. <laughs> Weren't expecting that, were you? <laughs> Remember I told you I used to help out in a haunted house and they closed the doors after 19 years? Well, the person that owned the air cannons, I called them and asked if I could buy them that I was going to start my own yard haunt. Dude, that's freaking awesome. He gave them to me. How do you say, sweet? <laughs> See, there's my uh, upper register again. I now have six large air cannons. That is so cool, dude. Emerald Gypsy Heart, I know how to do the baby registry. I will be creating an email associated with the Amazon registry and set it up if that's okay. A little closer to that time, of course. Yes, thank you, because uh, this person, not computer savvy. <laughs> I, I, I'm just, like, barely can Google something. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. GK Eagles 10, my sister had her appendix out. I'm too old to go to that hospital. Oh, well, I hope that she's doing okay, dude. Uh, Dabbit353, Mr. Bulldozer Videos. This is directed to Mr. Bulldozer Videos. Old props don't go away. They just find new haunts to hang out in. 
Great that they gave those to you. Oh, and spray butter? Hmm. Bloody popcorn was good, so why not? Exactly. <laughs> I, you know what I do is I spray the butter with... I, I put the spray butter on the popcorn, and then I put my ketchup. Okay. That's right. And then salt. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Pneumatics are good to be used amongst actors. The combination really works. I use them because I am the only actor, but two new... new, new <laughs> That's all, folks. Yeah, really. Two new neighbors moved in, and they are both doing yard haunts this year. That is really, really freaking awesome. Pumpkin Princess, 1031. Get well soon, Lori Lee. I have been. I'm almost there. Almost 100%. Glad to hear that you're home. You need to take it easy. Let Troy pamper you. I wish. I scratched your back tonight. Does that count? For five seconds, no. Ah. Mini Moose 1750, less than 100 days. Holy shiz! I know, right? And, yeah, stressing. Probably much more screwed than you guys. I'm expanding to almost three times more than what I've done in past years. Keith brought it to my attention the other day that pallets are already built. We have to build the panels this year. This year we were already starting to build. So, yeah, we're stressed too. Thanks again for the giveaway. Looks like I'm second place, so whatever inflatable HHN Survivor doesn't take will be used to help get my two little siblings into the holiday. This is really the perfect giveaway for me. Well, I'm glad everything's working out. Also good to hear that it's nothing serious, Lori Lee. Hopefully you'll be back at 100% today. Thank you. Thank you very much. And I loved your video. <laughs> HHN Survivor, I hope everything with Lori Lee will get better. I'm wanting to make a prop this year with an air compressor. I just thought it would be so hard to do. Um, everything's a learning process. Uh, so cool how the contest results happen to fall on my birthday. Well, happy birthday. Happy Yesterday, birthday. Yesterday, I guess. That is really cool. Well, yesterday, was it the whole vlog time continuum? I'm still it, lost. It and might. I live in it. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> K-Level 85. This is Keith, y'all. Whatever happened to that weird Keith guy? I don't know, Keith. Where are you? Exactly. And then Miss Loveseek, that's you. That's me. Said... Oh, that weird Keith guy needs to get his butt over here and start building. Yes. That's where building. the weird Keith guy needs to be. A couple of the others also commented, Viva, Viva Todd Vegas. Haven't heard from you in a little while. Um, How's it going? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Go. <laughs> oh, he actually said, yeah, you need an air compressor too. But uh, Eileen Norris said, hope Lori Lee feels better. Thank you. Halloween will creep up on you. Better be careful. How's Keith and Cheyenne? Um, they're both doing okay. Um, I talked to Keith today. Talked to him yesterday. And Bronson Haunted Hills also said, excuse me, Branson Haunted Hills also said, where's Keith? Um, Wish we knew, uh, Keith. I, <laughs> Mr. Bull, Mr. Bulldozer videos, Troy sending you an email regarding something very cool. Um, you might want to resend it because I haven't seen it. Guys, we had like a, there's been like probably about a hundred different emails and comments and everything. He had like a hundred emails, so you might want to send it again and put like capital letters. This is it, you know, just your name or something. I don't know. Yeah, it, it was really crazy day when I got home. And welcome back. FF looks at 40. Sorry, but like I told Lori Lee, I've been way behind on vlogs. I'm finally caught up, so here it goes. Congratulations on the baby results. Glad Popcorn is adjusting. Sorry you're not feeling well, Lori Lee. Troy, yes, the red plugs in the hospital are generated back up. Glad you're feeling better, Lori Lee. Wow, those scrap prices suck, Troy. Deep breath. <sighs> Until tomorrow. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> it's good to have you back. So, um, speaking of until tomorrow, I think that I might have left somebody out. If I left you out, I sincerely apologize. But anyway, guys, happy hunting. Hasta mañana. Uh, Arriva Dirci. And, uh, ja matine. Your head's gonna explode. I know. <laughs> happy hunting. Grr. Arg. 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 Arg.